The most important characters in an action film are heroes and villains. Every John McClane needs a Hans Gruber. Every Luke Skywalker needs a Darth Vader. But a super underrated character in action movies is the sidekick, the emotional support, comic relief, love interest. Sidekicks give us someone to relate to, someone to connect with, and of course, it doesn't hurt if they're good looking. In this video, we'll talk about sexy sidekicks in action films. First up, we have the Kira Knightley as Elizabeth Swan in Pirates of the Caribbean. Name a single person who didn't have a crush on Kira Knightley when Pirates of the Caribbean came out. Bet you can't. The woman is drop-dead gorgeous. We still have a crush on her. Knightley plays Elizabeth Swan in the film, a privileged daughter of Governor Weatherby Swan. At the start, she seems to be a perfect young lady in her fine silks, but secretly, Elizabeth is bored of Port Royal society. She has a wild side, and she craves adventure, and that's what draws her into the world of pirates. Yes, Elizabeth is Jack Sparrow's sidekick on the pirate ship, and a seriously beautiful one at that, but she's an incredibly strong character in her own right. She's very strong-willed, independent, and hot-headed. Even as a young girl, she wasn't afraid to speak her mind, and she never backed down from a fight. Don't think she's just a pretty face, guys. Elizabeth is easily the smartest character in the movies, outwitting Barbosa as a young girl, and even leading Jack Sparrow to most troubles. She's clever, she's tough, she's a pirate king, and definitely not someone to be messed with. Up next, the gorgeous Selma Hayek as Rita Escobar in Wild Wild West. Let's throw it back to the 90s, the era of Spice Girls, Friends, and the OG baddie Selma Hayek. Talk about flaming hot. The woman had an entire generation in a chokehold, and we get it. Hayek plays Rita Escobar in Wild Wild West, the iconic steampunk action comedy of 1999. Rita joins James T. West and Artemis Gordon in their mission to save captured scientists, one of whom is her husband, from the villain Dr. Arliss Loveless. Hayek is seriously sexy in this film. She poses as an entertainer to find her way into Loveless's mansion and free her husband from captivity. Her looks throughout the film are absolutely iconic, with the classic 90s blowout, a gorgeous red lip, and beyond on sexy dress. But Rita is more than just her looks. The woman is pretty badass. She single-handedly tricks a bunch of people to free Guillermo Escobar. Of course, she teams up with West and Gordon later on, but you have to give her credit for coming quite far on her own. She's fearless, she's relentless, she's very smart, along with being hot as hell. Moving on, let's talk about Queen Bey as Foxy Cleopatra in Austin Powers in Goldmember. Ladies and gentlemen, bow down to the queen herself. That's right, Beyonce is in the house, and it can't get sexier than that. The whole world is obsessed with the singer, including us, and her role in Austin Powers in Goldmember is pretty iconic too. For one thing, her name is Foxy Cleopatra. Name a more fitting name for Beyonce. We'll wait. Foxy is a former employee of Goldmember who is also an undercover spy and sidekick to Austin Powers. We don't know about you guys, but there's nothing we love more than sexy secret spies. Foxy decides to go to the future with Austin to defeat Goldmember once and for all. She wanted to stop Goldmember to avenge the death of her partner. Along the way, Beyonce and Austin reignite their romantic flame and become a couple. The role of Foxy was absolutely perfect for Beyonce. Foxy is bodacious, confident, and a total queen. The character is a comical combination of all the iconic black female movie characters from the early to mid-70s. The name is taken from Pam Greer's Foxy Brown. It's almost like the character was made for Beyonce, and she killed it. Foxy is a legend. Next, we loved Rachel McAdams as Irene Adler. Rachel McAdams needs no introduction. The absolutely stunning actress has acted in some iconic films, like The Notebook, Mean Girls, and About Time. We get to see her in a totally different role as Irene Adler in Sherlock Holmes, and this might be our favorite character of hers yet. Irene Adler is a prominent American thief, adventurous, and of course, Sherlock Holmes' love interest. She has led a totally wild, criminal life, with many thefts, including some from royal families to her name. She's also allegedly behind the breakup of a prince and a princess. Can't get more badass than this, folks. Along with being a criminal mastermind, Irene is also sexy as hell. She's confident, bold, and has no problem being naked in front of Sherlock, which was a huge deal back in the 1800s. But she's not your regular sidekick, dying for the protagonist's love and attention. In in fact, Sherlock tries really hard to track her, and she keeps slipping through his fingers. The two are often at odds. Irene works with his nemesis, who ends up getting her killed, but that's beside the point. Irene is super cool and definitely a top contender for a sexy sidekick. And now, how can we forget Anne Hathaway as Selena Kyle? Let's talk about the reigning queen of sexy sidekicks, Selena Kyle or Catwoman. How can you possibly top that latex costume, that feline energy? And we think everyone can agree that no one played that role better than the one, the only goddess of Hollywood. Anne Hathaway in The Dark Knight Rises. Selena Kyle is a world-class cat burglar and a mistress of disguise. She's cunning, she's devious, she's badass. 
and she targets Gotham's wealthiest for her schemes, and we love to see it. She encounters Batman when she infiltrates Wayne Manor, disguised as a maid. She proceeds to steal his mother's pearl necklace, and when confronted by Batman without his cape, she performs a set of seriously cool moves and manages to escape with no problem. But the bat and the cat keep running into each other, on one heist or another, and the chemistry between them is insane. Nothing says batty like Selina in her fitted cat burglar outfit, her red lip, dark eyes, and heeled boots. She's basically invisible with her abilities of disguise, cracking open any safe ever, agility, and of course, sex appeal. Anne Hathaway can really do no wrong. Next up, we've got Carrie Ann Moss as Trinity in The Matrix. All hail Carrie Ann Moss, queen of the 90s and early 2000s, and star of the coolest sci-fi film of all time, The Matrix. Moss plays Trinity, a Zion operative, the first mate of the Nebuchadnezzar, and Neo's lover. Like all the other main characters, Trinity is a computer programmer and hacker who has escaped from The Matrix. At the beginning of the film, she's the first mate on Morpheus's Nebuchadnezzar, and basically serves as a go-between for him and anyone he wishes to free from the Matrix. But later, she gets closer and closer to Neo, and the two become a thing. Trinity is a genius, skilled at operating computers and vehicles, both inside and outside the Matrix. A double-edged sword, she's also skilled at martial arts. And of course, she's drop-dead gorgeous. You don't want to mess with this triple threat. Moving on, Alicia Silverstone as the iconic Batgirl. Is there any 90s actor more iconic than Alicia Silverstone? You probably remember her yellow plaid outfit from Clueless, but she gets even cooler when you know that she played Batgirl too. That's right, Silverstone plays Barbara, or Batgirl, in the 1997 classic Batman and Robin. Barbara is Batman's second sidekick and Alfred's niece. She gets the suit from her uncle after learning about the Batcave and puts it on to reveal her cape, mask, high-heeled boots, and utility belt. And you know Silverstone looked killer in the Batgirl outfit. Of course, Batgirl is the coolest sidekick ever. Besides looking fabulous, she's also a genius with a photographic memory, hacking, and detective skills. She's also a skilled fighter and has the most beautiful hair too. Catwoman has some competition, ladies. Finally, let's talk about Rooney Mara as Lisbeth Salander in The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo. If you're more into the goth, spiky hair, black lipstick, a bunch of piercings vibes, we bet you loved Lisbeth Salander in The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo. Rooney Mara did an amazing job, and we're still upset that she wasn't called to reprise her role for the sequel. Lisbeth is the coolest character ever. She has a photographic memory and insane hacking skills, which seems to be a theme with these ladies. She's also kind of disturbed and intense, but they can't all be chirpy and blonde. In the movie, she teams up with Michael Blomkvist to solve the mystery around Harriet Vanger's disappearance. Lisbeth is a very complex and layered character, but she's very fascinating too. Definitely the most interesting character on this list. That's a wrap for this video. Who do you think is the most iconic sidekick of all time? Which of these sidekicks do you think is the sexiest? Let us know in the comments below. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one.